<laughs> oh yes. Yes, nice, big old fatty. Let's let her go. Yeah. And this guy feels whoa, he feels solid. Hello, it is adventure time. It is Memorial Day weekend. I have brought my tube to a lake I've been to many times. Awesome lake. I did a trip at this particular lake in the fall and it was phenomenal and I had what I thought was a camera failure. It turned out it was a memory card failure because it happened to be on another trip that was pretty good. So that memory card went into the weeds. So hopefully this one records. So I'm at a lake that kicks out Big Brook Trump. So I'm going to take my tube out. I'm trying out a brand new, I got a new toy. I got me a, a nine foot six or nine and a half foot six weight Scott Session. It's going to be, I'm going to throw an indicator rig on that. And then I got my Scott Centric. I'm going to use a midge tip. But, Hoping to get into some chunky brook trout. Let's go hit it. I'm excited. Let's go. Anyone that watches my channel knows I'm a fan of the Scott Fly Rod Company. Here's my new toy. The Scott Session 9.5 foot 6 weight. Yeah, I've tried it out already. It's awesome. So, But this is like the first weekend that I've used it. On that, we're ready to go. Let's rock. All right, we are off. Ah, I love this time of year. Got back to back uh, oh, a lot of trips and I've been hitting it hard uh, just a few days after this we're going to go float the green if they drop the flows or they're supposed to we're hoping and then uh, after that backpacking season it's been uh, three weeks from now I'm going on a mega trek after golden trout uh, the slate kicks out chunky book trout so I'm hoping um, I have a squirmy on, a micro squirmy on my, it's my point and a balanced damsel above that, but I watched a nice one swim right up to my squirmy directly below me and it denied it. So I'll probably be switching to a cronvid or balanced leech, I don't know. And I just flipped behind me to turn around and all some instant tug, so, and that had to have been right at the surface. I, I switched, I got rid of the squirmy put on the Oh, he's on the balance damsel. No, he's not. He's on the ice cream cone. Never mind. I switched to an ice cream cone because. Yeah, nice chunky brook trout. I love this thing. Hey, he's fat. Oh, a, that is a healthy guy. Fat, fat, fat. I love this. I love brook trout. They fight hard. Gorgeous. Fun, fun, fun. Oh, I love broke trout. Nice, fat. Ah, oh, so fun. Let's lay it go. Thanks, buddy. So much. Have fun. On the ice cream cone, about six and a half feet deep. In the mood to eat chronomids. Well, I think I it was in the water last 20 seconds and it went down again. I came to a little shower water and I wanted to, I was just watching it sink so I could know to change the depth of my indicator. And one just came out of nowhere below my feet and smashed the ice cream cone. And it's a good one. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh yeah, eat that. This is a nice big brook trout. And he's strong. Yeah, he is man, he's big. Oh yes. <laughs> oh, come here, buddy. Oh dude, he is huge. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that is a freaking toad of a brook trout. They oh man, definitely over three pounds, probably three and a half pound brook trout. <laughs> that is some tank. Definitely over three. Yes. And he also had this little micro balance leech, or half balance leech with a chartreuse bead in it. Yeah, someone looks like they use small X. I don't go lower than three. <laughs> yeah, all right. 
Extra fly and a massive brook trout. Big old fatty, yeah. <laughs> On an ice cream cone, pretty deep, about six, uh, six and a half, seven feet deep. Yes, nice, big old fatty. Let's let her go, yeah. <laughs> This mega fatty tore the crap out of my glove. <laughs> oh, let her go. She is fat. Let this big old fatty go. Oh, thank you so much. Ice cream cone. Oh, that was fun. That was a chunk and a half. <laughs> that was fun. Play getting some more of those. Awesome. I'm going to troll around a little bit with my midge tip. I got a black and red leech as my point. All of the Zebra Demon 2.0 non balance is my mid fly and a Cronrid Frenchie up top. Get more than 20 feet and I got a pretty solid whack. Didn't stick. Solid whack. Just trolling with the bitch tip. Don't know what it is. I don't think it's as big as that last one, but. No, oh, he, what's he on? I think he's on the chrome with Frenchie. Well, I am going to switch to all chronomids because... Well, whoa, 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 whoa! <laughs> oh, freaking love this. Yeah, he's on the chrome with Frenchie. Crap on me. I don't know, they're fatty, not as big as that last guy, but he's down. He's very nice, solid, solid. Chronomid Frenchie, yeah, I'm going to switch to all chronomids. Sexy female. Whoa. Awesome. Chronomid Frenchie, the Lance Egan masterpiece. Kudos to Lance Egan. I, I know you've never heard of him. He's new to fly fishing, but. He comes up with awesome patterns. Fish tip I switched to my point is a large ice cream cone. It's a large one. And then my mid fly, just when I was messing around with it, it's a black tinsel with a uh, turquoise tinsel wrapped around it, like ribbit with a rib and a, a red fluorescent butt with a silver bead. We'll try this. So I have hooked up with a chunker on the Chronomid Frenchie. Uh, yeah, it's how much. Ooh, this nice fatty yep, top fly. Do you, you know, oh man, he is strong. Oh, he's not. He's on the, no, he's on the front. Oh, another fat guy. Another healthy guy on the front with Frankie. That's good, nice, decent. Not as big as the other one I caught. He's probably close to two pounds. Yeah, let him go. Big fatty. Trying to make Frenchie. Yeah, yeah, well, yeah. Well, hooked up again. This time he is on the, the ice cream cone, the point. Ah, that is so fun. I love it. Oh crap, I went too far. Oh, that's no good. Now my top fly's caught in my tip of my rod, so. Hey. Ice cream cone right in the whip. Actually, it's a... Sorry, this guy was splashing around. I couldn't hear what you said. Oh, I was going to say, I have I spend more time outside than I do in the tent when I have the John Jackson set up. Let this nice female go. Eat the chronomid... Uh, not the chronomid, the... Well, an ice cream cone with gills, so... Hey, thank you, bud. Just two more. Stripping in the chronomids. We got sun to come out. My hands are freezing. <laughs> you can't catch 
not because my buddy's not here. <laughs> I always, I always felt, he told me the first time we ever came up here, he goes, oh, you ain't going to catch nothing until I catch something. That seems to hold true for you? <laughs> oh, yeah, it's definitely true for me. Well. I usually don't catch nothing until he shows up and he catches one. We'll see if he'll show up today. He might not. He's got other shit going on. Yeah. I forget that it's Memorial Day weekend, so. Yeah, I I kind of figured I wouldn't be here alone because it is a holiday weekend, but and this guy feels whoa, he feels solid. Well, I was kicking back in because I gotta use the restroom. <laughs> see. Oh crap! Yeah, maybe he's not terribly hard, huge because the ones that fight really hard never seem to be as big. <laughs> and he's got a lot of moss all over him. He's on the Cronvid Frenchie. No, he's not bad. Oh, man. No, he's on the uh, ice cream cone. Never mind. All right, not the Cronvid Frenchie. I'm on my point. See it, my camera's facing down. Dang it. Yeah, I learned. Cramped up. Whoa. Yeah, he's not that huge, but he's strong. Yeah, I thought he was a lot bigger. <laughs> Probably two pound fish though, so. Chunky guy, go. Whoa, go away. Stupid little clouds that just won't go away and blocking the sun and it's freezing. I didn't think I need layers because it was hot when I started hiking in, but uh, it's cold. Because my hands are freezing, stripping in the mid step, switch to my indicator rig. So I'm going to have to put these in the sun for about 10 minutes. They're wet, but they're warm. Hey, for the sun, oh, man. Some heat. Switch to a bounce of bruise leaves to come dip it under all these rocks where a lot of times the big ones like to hang out. Chop it up now, I can't see. The chronomage you want to breeze, but when sight fishing, you do not. Can't just spook the big old fatty. Dang it. Letting the wind troll me along. Got about another hour to fish, and then I'm gonna pack up and head to another lake. I forgot your name. Yeah, it's Dave. Dave? Dave, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm Kendall. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Kendall. Yeah, it's crazy. He was a really I've gotten four tugs in the last. 80 yards and not one is stuck. Hooked up. Good one? Somewhat of a decent. Nice. Yeah. Not very big. Not very big at all. Better than nothing, right? <laughs> Me and David doubled up. He's got one over there, and I was flipping around to go the way. And hooked up. He is on the ice cream cone. My point. Oh, there's a fat one. Yes, that guy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Man, they fight hard. 
on the ice cream cone. And it's, seriously, I've missed like five in that last bend. I mean, they are barbless hooks, but. It's deep in like it's gonna die. Oh, uh, guys, bat, 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 brook trout. Cool, well, anybody, thank you. On the ice cream cone. Good job, Dave. Heck yeah. <laughs> yeah. I I just did a battery swap, and I just, my hanging in the water, I hooked up twice. Oh, there we go. Just with it hanging in the water as I'm changing my battery. This is pretty, that's pretty funny. It's like all of a sudden it starts tugging. Man, oh, this is a good, oh, this is a good one, too. Man, ice cream cone. That's a chunky, too. Whoa, whoa, it just splashed the crap out of me. That is hilarious. In a matter of like one minute, I caught two. I had to, two, man, this guy's thick. Holy crap, I guess. Yeah, yes. the wind has picked up and it is chilly. I just to switch back to my indicator off because my hands are numb from stripping in the line. I uh, got a ice cream cone as my point, and a little bit up from that, a carmid known as the Brando. Looking over at Dave, and my indicator was under. Didn't stick. Dang it, just went down again. No stickage. What to do is look away, and then your indicator disappears. Is on the ice cream cone, not terribly huge, but still fun. Fat. Man, they're all fat. Uh, this lake is so much fun. Oh, come on, come on. Okay, this guy's got shoulders. Yeah, he's fat. Chunk or go. Love the crowd. Chunky, chunky. Ooh, on the ice cream cone. Wait, but thanks. Thanks again. <gasps> oh, this is so much fun. Um, yeah, my buddy used to work at a lodge up in Alaska. We went and fished up there in Glacier Bay. It's so fun. So, anyway. Yeah. Oh, nice. On oh, the ice cream cone again. There you're in the mood to eat the ice cream cone. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah, this guy is a little football. Oh. Not long, he's like 10 inches long, but obscenely fat. This guy is goofy fat. Come here, come here, buddy. <laughs> he's so fat. Just let him go, ice cream cone again. Down again. All right. Ah, oh, this is fun. Oh, right in the upper lip. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Huh? He, this, he's not that big, he's, he's, he's fat. He's, the ones that are like right around 13, 14 inches just fight. They eat, they eat their weenies. Oh, he's, dude, he's not, he's maybe 13 inches. And he's chunky. Man, it's fun, fun. Yeah, let's, let, let's let this guy go. That's my old chunky book trap. Swim away, thank you so much, buddy. Again. Wait for that indicator to go down. We'll try the second I turn off my camera. Oh, oh, do it, do it. Eat it again. There. Oh, dang it. <laughs> we should probably saw that. 
Man, I cast, I didn't get my camera on before that went down. Dude, are you sure you don't want to find a stick or something? I can give you one. I might have a bobber floating around. If you do, yeah, just go over there and cast it. Just cast out as far as you can and just. Because that's, I mean, that's what they're eating, obviously. <laughs> Okay. Oh. Yeah, man, you're in the mood to eat the ice cream cones. Huh? Almighty oh, Coronamid. Terribly, not terribly huge, but strong. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> oh, he's strong. Come on, buddy. Where are you at? Man, brook trout. I mean, they're all chunky in here, but they're just strong. Much funner to actually catch than cutthroat. Well, cutthroat are pretty. Oh, he got it on his own. Nice, nice, nice. Chunker. Hey, buddy. Thanks, buddy. Let's try this again. So many little taps. We're just like very little. Dunk. Wish me the second I hit the off button, it goes there. We go. Oh god. Man. It's so funny how that's all you need to do to get a take. Turn the camera off. Ah, oh, Dave is hooked up. Little tiny dinker. Better than nothing, that's what I always say. That's what I always say too, man. Anything, but I always say a good day on the water, or a bad day on the water beats a good day at work. Amen to that. Mm, he's got a hooky on him, he might be a male. You'd probably know better than me, bud. <laughs> Oh, nice. Good job, man. I am getting so many freaking bumps. You're having a good day over there, man. Yeah. Oh, go down, go down. Got the camera on. Oh, there we go. Dang it! <laughs> I had a tangle mess, so I clipped off my upper coronamid. I just, just have an ice cream cone on at the moment. I'm gonna bobber down on the ice cream. I just have a single ice cream cone on now. Uh, it's so fun, addicting, watching that bobber sink. This one is not big. But, oh my gosh, he's tiny. <laughs> well, apparently, I've just this was ones they just stocked last year. Apparently, because he's microscopic. Yes, <laughs> I'll take him. Show up, buddy. Show up. Yeah, it has a measuring across there. That's cool, dude. It's just built into it. One last fish. Bobber down. Yeah, so the trip I did a couple weeks ago was in a place where they require barbless hooks. So I I tied a bunch of those. That's just what I have. <laughs> oh, yeah, this guy's fighting. I don't think he's terribly huge, but... Yeah, it's got, yeah, I don't think he's that big. I think he's just enthusiastic. Yeah, he's not terrible. He's chunky. Oh, yeah. Ah, it's so fun. Oh, he's not bad, actually. He's thick. Yeah, right. uh, female. Ouch. Man, got off on his own. <laughs> one last fish, but I like this is gonna. I gotta get one more. I get that, dude. I, I was miserable for a long time, dude. Like, I'm almost back. Come on, go down. We did get bumped twice since I started up, but did not stick. Oh. Yeah, that was fun. A lot of fun. Well, that's it for the adventure. Thanks for tagging along. Uh, caught some nice ones. It was fun. Hanging coronamids. I gave uh, Dave here one under, put one under his bobber. Yeah, I mean, 
it is yet to go down, but hopefully he gets into hopefully. some with the ice cream cone. So sure to give it a you know thumbs up, like and subscribe. We'll see you on the next adventure. Well, unless I add this to another trip. I'm going somewhere directly from here to another spot in a different area. So appreciate the, the watch. We'll see you on the next one. Later.